Welcome to part three of our presentation on Sightline ERP and what comprises a world-class ERP system. In parts one and two, we discussed the inventory management system and engineering. Now we're going to talk about planning and scheduling and production. Sightline includes a complete planning engine that can run in either MRP mode or advanced planning and scheduling mode. With these tools, you'll be able to see your full material plan. What do I need to buy in order to satisfy my demand? What do I need to build? You'll be able to see your capacities, where you might be over capacity or restrained, bottlenecked in those capacities. You'll be able to see what materials are allocated to what demand. You'll be able to see, importantly, your projected dates. When will these goods be available, both in an available to promise mode and a capable to promise mode, which might include capacity restrictions. And of course, the system generates exception messages for you to warn you of areas where you may need to expedite materials or where you're going to be late. It's an incredibly powerful and detailed engine. It looks at all of your demand input, anything that you are demanding for customer orders, for your forecast, for projects, for service and repair orders, your safety stock levels, jobs on the floor. It's encompassing all of these inputs and taking them all into consideration, as well as your current inventory levels, your outstanding purchase orders for incoming goods, transfer orders from other warehouses or other sites. All of this is looked at. Optionally, you can add on an active forecasting module that will look at your history of up to the last five years of material usage or sales and will predict the next 12 months of usage based on that history. All of this outputs to the planner's workbench, a highly functional tool that in one place lets you see all the replenishments you need to execute, purchase orders, transfer orders, jobs on the floor, easily see what's supporting these demands, why they're being generated, and easily with one click execute a purchase order or execute a job on the floor to fulfill your requirements. Also, you can have a master production schedule for repetitive manufacturing or long lead time manufacturing to satisfy future demand, especially in a lumpy demand environment. All of this then feeds your production system. From the planner's workbench, you confirm jobs on the floor. That job, by default, will copy the current material and routing but could also copy any other material and routing, including materials and routings from the engineering sandbox. If you're a repetitive environment, Sightline includes a highly sophisticated production scheduling system that allows you to have rate-based production, for example, 100 of these a day across a cell of work centers. Those jobs on the floor or production schedules on the floor are dynamically scheduled by the sightline system based on available resources, standard run times, etc. This can be limited by finite capacity or infinite capacity, depending on whether you want to add capacity on the fly or if you're limited in that and you need to know when the system can actually project your delivery dates. You can have detailed costing job by job, operation by operation, work center by work center, or you can do period-based costing, especially for production schedules of repetitive manufacturing, where you can look at a period and see what your costs were and what your produced values were. You have real-time production screens as people clock in and out, complete operations across the floor using our shop kiosks. You'll see on the system where the progress of your jobs are, where they're late, who worked on what, and exactly what the scrap levels were. Sideline also has an available quality system that allow you to execute quality tests as product moves across the floor, move products to material review board for review, corrective action, potentially return product to vendors, and record these tests as the product moves across so they are able to be printed as certificates to the customer at the end. When you set up your routings, your bills, your jobs on the floor, you can optionally backflush your material, your labor, your machine time, or designate that at specific operations these must be reported. 
You can print your paperwork when you release the job, or you could run paperless through the kiosks, allowing your employees to walk up to a kiosk, clock in, see what's next to be run, look at the paperwork online, and proceed without actually having to print anything physically out. If you're a process manufacturer, someone who deals with paint or foods, things that may have ingredients or formulation, Sightline has an optional process module that allows you to set up those process items, indicate what their formulas are or their ingredients are by percentage or weight or amount, adjust those percentages across the formulation, have multiple formulations for the same item, have your specific specifications for how you wish that item to be manufactured, release those items to a job batch on the floor and manage your batches on the floor across the system. This also includes a full recall capability. So if you have a lot that was bad, if there's a problem with product in the field, we can trace cradle to grave what product that went into, what customers received it, what products were composed of that particular lot. This also permits you to have co-jobs, meaning I can have a batch that's going to make more than one specific SKU out of the same batch. That's the end of part three of our presentation. In part four, we'll be discussing the purchasing and order entry systems of Sightline ERP. Thank you.